are you watching? These are lots of fish keepers put fish into their aquariums. Even you may be. However, it is not the correct way because due to the overstocking of fish, they become super stressed and gradually those fish fall into death. Then what is the real way to stock aquarium with fish? If you search on the web, then you may see there is a thumb rule of it and that is one gallon of water is required for every one inch of fish. Is that true? Should you follow this thumb rule? Today this episode of Aqualife Expert will dig down this and analyze how many fish are suitable per gallon in aquariums. So stay tuned till the end. If we understand the type of fish, then 50% of the query will be solved. You must remember each and every fish doesn't have the same aggression level. For example, cichlids are generally aggressive fish, whereas goldfish are not. Not only that, but some fish like goldfish koi create lots of biological waste, so you cannot apply that 1 inch per gallon method for them. Furthermore, you have to know about the schooling types of fish. They cannot live without a group. If it happens, then their life expectancy will decrease a lot. Now if you want to apply that thumb rule, then it's better to apply it on slender fish like neon tetra, zebra danios, guppies, small birds, rasboras, etc. Goldfish are big bodied fish, so for them 1 inch for 3 gallon is maybe suitable at the initial stage depending upon their types. We are exceptional because they grow way larger and a minimum of 250 gallon is required for one medium sized koi. So you must know their adult size before stocking aquariums. Some fish like pleco, oscars and some types of cichlids grow larger than other fish. So for them you must start with at least 75 gallons per pair. However, don't mix those fish anyhow, otherwise your aquarium will be dead soon. So the third factor is fish habitat. Generally most of the cichlids come from Africa and South America. Now you have to imitate a similar environment inside your aquarium, which may not be suitable for other fish like goldfish or other smaller fish. There is another thumb rule of stocking aquariums. It is based on surface area of water. According to this, you can stock aquariums 1 inch of fish per 12 square inch of area. Like thumb rule 1, it is not applicable for every fish. But it is much more reliable than the previous one. However, apply 1 inch of fish per 24 square inch of surface area rule for big bodied fish. These are basic concepts of stocking fish in aquariums. But you have to consider many side factors here. These are filtration, life plans, swimming space, bacterial colony, substrate and more. So I recommend starting with 5 numbers of any small teeny schooling fish with 10 gallons of tank. It will give experience of fish keeping. If you learned something new and got some value then share it with your friends. Don't forget to subscribe to get updates regarding fish keeping. That's all for today, Aqualife Export signing off.